Hi everyone, this is going to be a really quick video. I saw online that if you install the MacDo Philippines application, you can get a free cheeseburger. And this application is available for iOS, so that's Apple phones like the iPhone, and also available for Android. Now I'm having to install it on the Android because my iPhone isn't registered to the Philippines and they've limited the application only to Philippine registered accounts, which is really annoying. Anyway, we can do it here on the Android device. Now I believe, according to their site, this promotion is available until June 20th. So if you're going to do this, you have to be pretty fast. So let's just install the app and then see how it works. Now I have to say I'm not a big fan of the McDonald's Philippine delivery website because it's really not very smooth. There's so many things you have to click all the time and then when you think you've finished the order, it's like you have to click one more time and then one more time and one more time and so many times I've like made an order online with McDonald's and then I've realized like after 20 minutes I didn't press the last final checkout button. So yeah, I'm hoping the application's much better. Let's have a look. So you can see we've got three options, log in with Facebook, log in with a McDo account, or don't have an account yet. Now you can only get the free cheeseburger if you sign up for a new account, so I'm going to just do that. It's kind of annoying, um, because you would think that to entice people to install the app, they would just give a free cheeseburger to everyone, whether you have an account already or not. Uh, so yeah, kind of annoying. Anyway, let me fill this in and then continue. And there you go, you've now received a free cheeseburger coupon. So let's check our coupons redeem so there you go free cheeseburger but why is it limited to new accounts only the idea of this promotion is to bring new users to the application so let everyone have a free cheeseburger in return for installing the app don't just limit to those who create a new account that's kind of silly anyway add to cart your coupon will be added to the cart are you sure you want to redeem yes And after clicking yes, I'm just left here. This is one of the annoying things I hate about their website, that when you do something, it just leaves you sitting there and then you have to click something else, like click back. Why isn't it just kicking me to the menu straight away? Anyway, let's go to Mac Delivery. Updating app, I guess it's like downloading the most recent menu. Um, I don't know if that does it every time you open the app or just now and then. So let's see how the app is. Let's go to add-ons, I'll get a large fries add to order yeah see like I don't need this pop-up that I then have to click again just do it and then let me move on to something else um, it's one of the annoying things with their website there's always like pop-ups do you want to do this do you want to do that check out this like no just leave me alone and let me order um, let's go for corn add to order yeah let's go to mushroom soup add to order they really need to hire someone who knows about user interface because they're not very good at it. Um, let's go to desserts. Um, now this is the old McFlurries. At the moment it's meant to be the Angry Bird McFlurries, but this is just Oreo um, and Red's Cotton. These are like the old ones. Anyway, let's go for a regular Oreo McFlurry. See, like, do you want to add this? Just stop hassling me. I just want to do my order. Leave me alone. Look, no thanks. And then, are you sure? <laughs> like, another pop-up. Go away. Um, Guaranteed delivery in 30 minutes, well, I can tell you most of the time that doesn't happen, um, so that's really not true. Anyway, let's just get this order finished so that I can show you the final checkout. I'm sure there's many people out there who've already got this app and have been using it and probably like it. Um, it certainly seems faster than their website, but there are still some things I would like to see improved. So I've got Oreo McFlurry, mushroom soup, corn, large fries, the free cheeseburger, let's just check out. A verified email address is required to proceed with your order. Press OK to verify your email. OK. Email sent and I've clicked the link to verify. So let's try check out again. So now I just have to fill in my name, address and everything like that. So now I want to finish. It says please add at least one contact number to your profile. But you can't do it anywhere on this checkout page. So now I have to find another area in the app to put in a phone number. This is like not user friendly at all. Uh, so I just went into my profile and set a phone number and now it's saying please register an address on your profile. Why do I have to do that when I just filled it in here? You know what everyone, I'm not even going to bother with this anymore. Um, the McDo app sucks basically. I'm giving it a thumbs down. I don't care about the free cheeseburger. Um, their website sucks but at least I can use it and I'm already registered. So sorry guys, no free cheeseburger. I give up. 